This is an inspection horror story. Typically, home inspections go well. You have a hiccup every now and then. However, on occasion, they can really go sideways. That's why we always go to home inspections, whether we're representing the buyer or the seller. Now, this particular situation, now this is a true story, it was a frame house, it was an older house, the inspectors were a father and son team, they come in the house, they do their stuff, and we're like 20 minutes into the inspection, and the father comes out and says, you know, I have this theory, this property has termites, the termites are crawling up the sides of the garage door, and come out here, I want to show you something, see how the garage is sagging, that's because of termites and they've gotten into the support structure above the garage door and it's damaged. I can't fit up there and I can't see it, but I'm pretty sure this is what's happening. At this point, the buyer is noticeably upset. She's starting to have tears. Um, her agent's not present. He's the member of a team, so we, myself and her, we try to reach the agent, can't reach and leave a voicemail. We call the team leader, we call the transaction coordinator, no calls back can't get through. Now the home inspector, 10 minutes later, he's a big guy, he's got a big old beer belly, and because it's a frame home, there's a crawl space, and he has to get in the crawl space, I'm like, there's no way this guy's gonna fit in this crawl space. So what he does, he says, look, I'll cut you a break. Since this, problem's, this property's got issues, I'll just charge you half price and call it a day and I'll be gone. And this point, the buyer is crying, tears running down her face. We still can't reach the agent or anybody from his team. She walks off and leaves. Now we have a situation. They cancel the contract. But we have somebody saying the property has termites and there's structural issues. So what do we do? We have to clear this for the seller because they have to sell their home and we have the property disclosed. So we had a, a proper termite inspection done. Guess what? no termites whatsoever in the property, so that was incorrect. Then we hired an engineer. The engineer came into the property, inspected everything, and now engineer has all these cool things. They got cameras and infrared, and what he did was he actually had a, a camera on a pole, and he stuck it way up inside the attic, and he could see the support structure. And guess what? No termite damage, nothing at all. In fact, this guy represents homeowners and lawsuits, this particular engineer, we do a lot of business with him, and he's familiar with that model home, and he said it's typical to have a little bit of sagging on the garage, no damage, no issue, and it'll drop maybe an inch or two, but there's no problem whatsoever. So what we did was, we actually found another buyer, got the property under contract, and then we sent the engineer's report and the WDO, Wood Destroying Organism Report, to the other agent and had their buyer sign everything. So that way our client, the seller, is completely protected, everything's disclosed, and we're good to go.